new regulations for fishing in Michigan. Good evening, everyone. I'm Shannon Kantner. The Michigan DNR has a series of changes to fishing regulations that are set to take effect Monday. Alyssa Fenske talked with local fishermen today as they prepare for the next fishing season and the new changes. Fishing has always been a big part of Terry Gottschalk's life. Since I got older, I only fished two or three times a week. It used to be seven days a week. He's seen his fair share of fishing seasons and seems unfazed that this year's pike and musculon will have stricter limitations. In the past, there's been a limit of five northern pike. It has been reduced to two. There's a slot limit involved in that. And now you're only allowed one musculon per year. And you have to have a musky tag, which is free of charge to do that. Regulations on the fish isn't the only area to see change. Crossbows are now being considered okay where bow and arrow use is allowed. It might make it easier for maybe handicapped people to uh, fish. Sucker sparing is still something that, you, that younger guys like to do. And now they'll be able to use a crossbow doing that if they like. Here, fishermen consider the new regulation something not too far from what is normal, though next year may be a whole nother story. There has been talk that fishing licenses may double in price. There are talks where it was going to become an all species. They were going to do away with the restricted, then the extra stamps you'd have to add to it. And so if it was just a one shot all species, I think it might encourage more people to go out and fish for other species of fish. Those visiting the state might not be as pleased, but Gottschalk hopes the DNR will use the extra money to boost popularity that's dwindling for the sport. It used to be that's one of the things that kid had to do other than play baseball. In Jackson, Alyssa Fenske, Fox 47 News. Netting regulations for this year have also been changed to better fit this fishing season.